How's it going guys? Welcome back to another daily vlog. Uh, today, obviously, I've just finished school, so the time is currently... It's going really early today. It's currently half past three. Uh, it's just about ten minutes to get home. Um, so, yeah, anyway. Today, I want to try and make the vlog a lot longer. I want it to be better. And, yeah, I don't know. I just feel like they're not very long at the moment. I don't feel like it's my best effort. And obviously, I know that it's it's all my fault. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give that now. It is my fault that the vlogs aren't long. But hey ho, I can always make a good vlog, and hopefully that like the, this channel is also growing rapidly as well, guys. So thank you very much for that. I have something to say later on in the vlog. I'll probably do it now. Whilst I'm home alone, real quick. So I uh, just sit down with the camera and quickly talk. Um, yeah, I was thinking about it earlier, and I wanna. I, I put it in a good perspective, so that was, that was the right word, I think. I think that was the right word. Um, anyway, so I'm putting it into that now. I think I can remember what it was about. Don't think I can remember. Damn it, that's going on. It'll come back to me later on, hopefully. If I do, if, if it does even, uh, I'll talk about it, obviously. So, I want to try and make the vlog how it used to be. I want to try and put it in with the slow motions, the time lapses, and everything else. The only way we can do that is if we crack on with today. So let's get into it. Also, a quick thing, guys. When I do vlog like this for a long time, it kills my arm, so just I hope you guys appreciate that I'm going through pain to vlog for you guys right now. Also, I can switch hands, but my shoulder's killing me. Oh, this camera off. Wait, sure, I'm in shock because that's what you need to be when you're a vlogger, mate. You need to be in the bloody shop. Earlier today, I was talking to my mate about about something that obviously you guys kind of know a bit about, but something that you don't actually know too much about, if you guys understand what I mean. Like, I've, like I've told you stuff about it, but not the full story. This morning, I felt ridiculously good about myself, and I don't want to sound big headed or anything when I say this, but my head of year walked into my tutor and was talking to us about CVs and stuff. And he suggested that I were to put the charity fundraising events on our CV and stuff I did. And everyone kind of looked at me and I, I just, but because he was talking about me in such a positive way and it kind of made me realise that I don't want to sound okay when I say this but I am proud of what I've done and obviously it, it, I couldn't have done it without everyone who supports me and I uh, daily and stuff like that and it is it's it's crazy that such a, a like a big thing to some people and like such a and even though it could be such a small thing to people like people some people don't even care about raising money for charity and stuff. At the end of the day, when I do these charity events, I don't just sit there and, uh, and I, I just be like, you know what, it's, it's all gonna be fine. I, I sit there for hours and hours and hours planning and planning. It's not as easy as you guys think to just produce a charity event. You've, you've, it's gonna be, planning charity events does take a long time. It's not gonna just come to your head. Like me and Lucas sat here last, like, not last Friday, two weeks ago. Two weeks ago on Friday, planning, planning the event because it's not just something that's going to happen by itself. You've got to, you've got to think about how we're going to raise money and how we're going to do it. And I know it's crazy that that a lot of people just the, the ideas come to them frequently and efficient, efficiently. And we we have very great minds, but like I don't want to sound big headed again, but. The way our minds work, me and Lucas together, we, we've got that chemistry and we think a lot alike and we know what works and what doesn't work because we've done this many, many a times. It's, I definitely done this many times, but I've done what? I want to say five, six charity events. And I don't want to I don't want to sound big headed when I say this and stuff, but I am super, super proud of everyone who supported me and obviously I have to be proud of myself because I, I don't do these things to, to be popular or to get recognition or something like that. I do this because because I, I just want to. I it, there, there is no reason to do it, I know, but I just, I like the enjoyment I see on people's faces. It's not like I like the attention because that's not something that I'd, I'd do. I wouldn't just raise money just to get attention from people. I would, I, I just, I like the way when, when we do something like, something that's big to do with charities and stuff, people come together as one and they kind of, all, they, they, they I feel like all the negative stuff just gets swiped away and all the positives come in and I feel like I, I, I feel that's a good thing as well and I know I've, I've, I've talked a lot about just one thing that happened to me this morning but it really is something that 
die and passionate about and stuff like that.